Hey everybody, Coach Mark here, Ottawa Triathlon Club. Today we're going to talk a little bit about hydration. So when it comes to hydrating for a relatively short workout, something like, for example, our TTP class, the most important part about hydration is to show up to the workout already hydrated. Because when you're working out for an hour or so, your fluid demand isn't really that high. And for most people, one bottle should suffice. As we move downstairs with the TTP and start to do some of the strength work, you might have to refill your bottle. But just remember that us as human beings, we're absolutely, our bodies are amazing machines and we are meant to go for really, really long distances. Just remember to rehydrate and refuel after the work is done. For these shorter type of workouts, a sports drink really shouldn't be necessary. And you know what, if you haven't had a chance to have a bite to eat or a little snack before you start your workout, they can definitely do in a pinch, but be careful. Because these sports drinks have a lot of sugar in them and they're a huge source of, source of calories and really aren't necessary. You'd be much better off to have a healthy snack like an apple and peanut butter or a banana and just use your water bottle during your workout. That being said, I'm totally not opposed to sports drinks and believe me, I've drank my fair share of Gatorade. So for any exercise that lasts longer than 90 minutes, us as human beings, we don't only need to rehydrate to replace the fluid that we're losing in sweat, we, we also need to replace some of the sugar that we're losing because our bodies can't store more than, more than about 90 minutes worth. So this is when a sports drink like Gatorade or Powerade can be particularly useful as we're hydrating at the same time as we're fueling. However, some people don't really like Gatorade and Powerade. They find it too sweet or for whatever reason it doesn't agree with them. That's okay because the latest science says that it doesn't matter if you're eating a banana or eating a gel, taking in water or drinking Gatorade and Powerade. As long as you're replacing your fluid, getting in some sugar, your per performance really shouldn't suffer. So finally, the question of electrolytes come in whenever we talk about hydration. And some people swear by electrolytes and other people say they don't need them. Personally, I think they work for me. And the best way to answer whether or not it's going to work for you is try it. Be your own science experiment. All right, guys, so that's all for now. Coach Mark, Ottawa Triathlon Club. Cheers.